Welcome to our Legal Sex Summit 2023 awards video. We're sitting down today talking all about, yeah, absolutely. We're talking very much about our winners for the Distinguished Peer Awards and how we're excited to welcome them to Baltimore of all cool places for a May the 4th Be With You Distinguished Peer Awards reception. So yes. I'm Beth Ann Stewie. I'm the Director of Publications and Press for ELTA. And I am joined by my, truly, and I say it all the time, but one of my very favorite Eltons, Kenny Leckie from Traveling Coaches. Kenny, welcome. Thank you very much. It's great to be here. And it's good to see you. And I'll be seeing you. Thank in you. Person here in just I do feel like I did just see you for a legal second, what do we say, October? But this one's going to be bigger and better. Of course, we're finally getting it back to the slot on yes. the calendar where it belongs, where it started, where it's where it got its birth and has grown to what it is today. So I'm pretty excited about that. And I'm kind of interested for this one for us, for Legal Sack and the Distinguished Peer Awards to be together. I think that that's a really great amalgam of content and more importantly, of people. I agree. I agree. Nope. So, yeah. so go ahead, please. So the uh, having the award ceremony at this event, I think is really good. The, the event itself, I'm a huge fan. been going since it started. I've watched it grow and develop into a great you know, laser focused thing around, a, you know, security as it affects the legal community. Love that. But we're having the award ceremony and it's its own thing. So I have a great privilege of, of being master of ceremonies at this thing. And so I love it. The fact that it's a distinguished peer award uh, means these are, these are things that the people that we work with, the community that we live in have, have voted that this, and they acknowledge accomplishment of individuals, of, of, of things they've done, things they've written, uh, products and services they've developed and rolled out. I, it's a fantastic uh, event. And it's really interesting for us because I think every year we've added, especially over the last two years, we've added even more categories and award recipients. And this year we have our largest number of young professionals ever, 27. I saw that. I love that. I, 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 if, if, if the same group that started this, that's worked in this forever, are the only ones still doing it, that means there's, there's an end to this thing. I love seeing young professionals and, and folks coming out and, and getting involved and, and really putting their expertise on display and then being honored at this award ceremony. I, I just, I, I'm pretty jazzed about that long list of young professionals as well. Well, we hear all the conversations that, you know, legal tech is a little stagnant age groups and kind of demographic. This young group of professionals really pushes it the other way. And why do you think that these awards are going to be so important for them? Do you think it's going to help them kind of get maybe a mentor or their bearings in legal tech in ways they wouldn't have otherwise? Well, I, I think several things come out of that. And this is true of anyone. If you map out your career path, you look back, there were people that acknowledged that saw you and that you are seen and you are recognized as having gifts and talents that are good uh, and have uh, impact on a lot of people. That's what this is for these people at this point in their career. And I see it as just catapulting what it does. Success drives success. And, and, and these types of uh, recognitions for things and actual effort made, not just for showing up, but doing something and doing it well, I think will catapult their career in a very positive trajectory. I'm excited to see so many of them in one place and hear their stories and see where their careers are really going to go. But we know they're going to be there. Why do you think someone should attend the Distinguished Peer Awards? Oh, it's one, it's a party. So it's a right. celebration. It is a, a culmination of a lot of hard work. And even if there were folks that were up for a certain award, didn't get it, there is such a, a, a spirit of just excitement around the accomplishment of of others. So that I, I haven't seen that in other places is, you know, the losers walk away angry. That's not the case. This is, we, we all are in this to provide, you know, service to the legal community and to be acknowledged in this way. It's just a, it's just a great celebration of people's work. That is a fantastic way to put it. And there's so much education and our legal sec summit sessions and so much good connection at our distinguished peer awards. And I'm looking forward to seeing you on stage. I'm a little nervous. You never know what's going to come out of this mouth. So it'd be worth coming just to see what just kind of is going to happen on the stage. <laughs> we'll leave that in here in the event that we're going to need it uh, for litigation later. Nice. Well done. It's, it's always good to be prepared. Awesome. Okay, I'll see you in just a couple of weeks. All right, Bethan. Always good to see you. See you Thank soon. Thank you. Thanks.